Hi guys! Welcome back sa YouTube channel ko. So for today, tuloy natin yung continuation mga Lodi ng general mathematics natin in which yung magsisolve tayo ng rational inequalities. So dun sa nakaraan nating video, nagsolve tayo ng rational inequalities na kung saan yung mga numerator at denominator natin are all linear. What if naging quadratic na siya or even cubic uh, uh, or even more degree, di ba mga Lodi? So, ituturo ni Sir IJ kahit yung mga quadratic lang para at least magkaroon kayo ng idea paano siya isosolve kapag nagkaroon ka na ng either quadratic na numerator or denominator sa rational inequality. Pero same approach lang din, gagaya ng video natin na nauna. Okay, number one. Number one. Solve the inequality x squared plus 8x plus 15 all over x plus 2 is greater than or equal to 0. So, first place, mga Lodi, Itong numerator nyo, napapansin nyo, factorable yan. Alam natin na ang 15 can be expressed as 3 times 5. Na kung saan yung 3 and 5 na yan, pag inad natin, will become 8. So, this can be rewritten as x plus 3 multiplied by x plus 5 all over x plus 2 is greater than or equal to 0. Okay? And then, yung next step natin, di ba mga Lodi? Kunyari, naka-factored form na lahat-lahat. We have to check the right side. If you recall it clearly, mga Lodi, from the last video that we had, so the right side must be equal to zero. Because if it's not, if that is not equal to zero, then you must do something first to make it zero on the right side of the inequality. Since eto zero naman to mga Lodi, wala na tayong problema yan. Next step, we need to find the critical values. Ani mga critical values? So yung una nating critical value is yung denominator must not be equal to 0 so x must not be equal to negative 2, therefore itong negative 2 nyo mga Lodi, isasalin nyo siya dun sa number line na gagawin nyo pero nakaanulit siya yung bilog na walang shaded or shallow ba mga Lodi kasi hindi po siya kasali uulitin ko kasi division by 0 is undefined, so that is not defined, okay next ang next step natin, dun naman tayo sa numerator, yung numerator natin equate natin sa 0 To determine the other critical values, so this is equal to zero. Obviously, applying the zero property, mga lodi, the zero product property. So we have x equals negative three. Equate lang to the zero. Eto rin. Tapos x equals negative five. Ang tanong sir IJ, kasali po ba yung negative three and negative five? So pag sa numerator, mga lodi, tignan yung ulit maigay kung may equal ba yan. Since dun sa unang nating example, may equal siya, greater than or equal. Etong dalawang to, they are included, they must be shaded. So they are inclusive. Ito kasi exclusive. Lagyan natin ng ano, exclusive kasi hindi siya kasali. Tapos etong dalawang to will be inclusive, mga lodi. Okay? So ang gawin na natin, gawa na tayo ng number line. So gawa tayo ng number line. So meron tayong uh, hatiin natin to mga lodi para kita natin. So, ano yung mga critical values natin? Negative 5, negative 3, and negative 2. So, gawa tayo ng number line. So, nandito example yung negative 5. So, syempre yung negative 5 nasa kaliwa yan. So, this is negative 5. Kasali po yan. Kasi nga, may equal tayo, di ba? Yung negative 3, kasali din po. Pero itong negative 2 mga Lodi, hindi kasali. Exclusive po yan. So, kung mapapansin nyo, dun sa mga nakaraang videos natin, meron tayong mga 3 regions. Pero kapag dagdagan na yung mga critical values natin, then we will have more regions to test. For this case, meron tayong region 1, region 2, eto region 1, region 2, region 3, and region 4. So meron tayong apat na regions na itetest. Okay? So tanggalin na natin. So ano yung unang case, Sir IJ? So case 1, yung region ng x is less than negative 5. So ito, Ka, uh, sorry, it must be x is less than or equal to negative 5 Kasi nga kasali po yan Lahat po nang nasa kaliwa ng negative 5 Itetest nyo dito So, isip ka ng number na lang na nasa kaliwa ng negative 5 Huwag yung negative 5 Kasi magiging 0 siya So, kailangan mas mababa dun So, try natin yung negative 6 Yung pinakamalapit na So, at x equals negative 6 Substitute nyo siya dito So, that is negative 6 plus 3 Multiplied by negative 6 plus 5 all over negative 6 plus 2 is greater than or equal to 0 simplify natin mga lods negative 6 plus 3, negative 3 this is negative 1 negative 3 times negative 1, positive 3 negative 6 plus 
that is negative 4. 3 over negative 4. So obviously that is negative 3 fourths. Or that is a negative number. Greater than ba siya or equal to 0? Diba hindi mga lodi? Therefore, itong region na to is not included. Ito mali po yan. Therefore, this is x. Not included siya mga lodi dun sa solution set natin. Okay, next. Try natin yung region 2 natin in between. So meron tayong case 2. So, yung case 2 natin will be ganito. So, for the second case, uh, negative 5 less than or equal to x less than or equal to negative 3. So, isip ka na lang ng in-between yan. So, obviously, eh, negative 4 yung nasa gitna. So, ganun. At x equals negative 4, same process, palitan yung x ng negative 4. So, meron tayong negative 4 plus 3 multiplied by negative 4 plus 5 all over negative 4 plus 2 this must be greater than or equal to 0. Test natin. Negative 4 plus 3, negative 1. Negative 4 plus 5, positive 1. Negative 1 times neg positive 1, that is negative 1 over negative 2. Pag sinimplify nyo to, this is negative over negative. That is positive, mga lodi. So, we have 1 half is greater than or equal to 0. So, since this is check, this is check, it follows na yung isang solution natin is ganito. Or kapag in-express natin to as interval notation, so included parehas, gamit tayo ng bracket. Okay? From negative 5 to negative 3. Next, punta tayo dito sa gitna ng negative 3 tsaka negative 2. So, meron tayong ikatlong case. So, ano yung nasa gitna ng negative 3 and negative 2, mga Lodi? Siyempre, negative 2.5 eh. So, ganun na. So, meron tayong case 3, mga idol. Uh, negative 3 kasali yung negative 3 less than or equal to x but less than negative 2 so in between nila negative 2.5 baka nalilito dito ha nilagay ko lang po na equal siya kasi nakashaded po siya kasali po siya dun sa solution set natin so try yung x is uh, negative 2.5 so testing nyo lang so that is negative 2.5 plus 3 multiplied by negative 2.5 plus 5 all over negative 2.5 plus 2, must be greater than or equal to 0. Tapos, mga Lodi, sige, kayo na lang siguro mag-compute nito, pero pag chinek nyo, ito is positive. Ito is positive. Ito is negative. Positive times positive, that is positive over negative, that is negative. Since negative number siya, hindi siya greater than or equal to 0. Therefore, hindi po siya solution. So, this is x. Tapos, yung case for siguro mga Lodi, bibigay ko na lang sa inyo yung gagawin. So, try nyo yung negative 1 and then i-substitute nyo dito. So, gawin nyo yung mga lodi, I mean, on your party lang. Tapos, i-test nyo siya. I-test nyo yung pang-apat na case. So, for example, negative 1 siya. Negative 1 plus 3, that is positive 2. Negative 1 plus 5, that is positive 4. So, positive times positive, that's positive. Negative 1 plus 2, that is positive 1. Positive times positive, that's positive over positive. That is still positive. Therefore, tama tong region na to. So, ibig sabihin, magsasatisfy yung x is greater than negative 2. Kasi nga, pakanan, tas hindi kasali to. Sir IG, paano ko siya isusulat as interval notation? So, ganito nyo siya isusulat. So, from negative 5 to negative 3. Negative 5 hanggang negative 3. Yun yun, nang since greater than negative 2 siya, so negative 2 will be parenthesis, mga idol. Tama ba? Kasi nga, hindi siya kasali. Tapos hanggang infinity na siya. Yung infinity naman, tsaka negative infinity, lagi naman exclusive siya. Therefore, ito na yung magiging final answer natin, mga idol. Ganun po siya. Okay? So, ganun po yung gagawin natin. So, same process din sa number 2. Okay? If ever you have questions or clarifications, huwag kayo mahiya. Welcome kay lahat mga lodi and I'll try my best para makareply sa mga comments niya or clarifications. Okay? So, for number 1, ito yung tamang sagot. Negative 5 to negative 3, at, uh, inclusive hanggang uh, uh, union of negative 2 exclusive hanggang infinity exclusive. Okay? So, ito, burahin ko na muna ito mga idol. Ayan. Okay, we have the second problem, ganun din. So, yung denominator, isip ka ng dalawang numbers ng product negative 24 tas yung sum negative 5. So, that is negative 8 tsaka positive 3. So, dapat mabilis mag-isip. If ever, pwede naman kayo mag-trial and error. Pero if you, have, you can think as fast as you can, and be sure na tama yun. So, much better. So, we can rewrite. Sige, lagay na lang natin dito mga Lodi. So, for number 2, 
we can write this as x plus 6 all over x minus 8 multiplied by x plus 3. Greater than 0. So, greater than 0 na yan, mga lodi. Wala nang equal. Ano first step? Kunin po, sir, ij, yung critical values. Mali. Dapat check muna kung 0 yung right side. Diba? O, nakalimutan mo agad, lodi. Since 0 na yan, wala tayong problema. Okay na tayo dun. Next, critical values. Denominator, equate natin sa 0. x minus 8. x plus 3 is equal to 0. Pero not equal to 0 yan. Diba, mga lodi? So, x must not be equal to 8. Tapos, x must not be equal to negative 3. So, yung 8 and negative 3, kasali dun sa boundaries natin. Okay? So, siguro yung number 2, tuturo ko lang ng medyo fast pacing. Pero, for sure, dapat yun, naiintindihan nyo pa rin. Dahan-dahanin pa rin natin. Pero, I mean, medyo mag-advance lang ng konti. So, for the numerator, so, x plus 6 is equal to 0, x equals negative 6. Kaya lang, ang tanong ko sa inyo mga lodi, kasali ba tong negative 6 or hindi? Uy, napaisip si Lodi. Hindi kasali. Bakit? Walang equal. ba? Sinabi ko lagi, kapag nagsasolve kayo ng rational inequality, yung numerator, the value of the variable that will make the numerator equal to zero will depend kung kasali ba siya or hindi. Kung ano yung inequality dito. If greater than lang siya or less than, obviously hindi siya kasali. Pero pag may equal, kasali siya. So that is shaded siya dun sa part na yun. Pero since ito greater than lang, ito hindi kasali. Therefore, ito, uh, itong mga value natin negat Yung 8 and negative 3 This is exclusive Ito exclusive din Okay So gawa tayo ng number line mga Lodi Kicks Negative 6, negative 3 8, ano pinakamaliit? Obviously sir IJ negative 6 Ito negative 6, hindi kasali Negative 3, hindi rin kasali Tapos meron tayong 8 na hindi rin kasali Itest natin ang apat na region Case 1 Ito so, for case 1, sige, lagay na nga din natin. Pero lalagay ko na lang siguro yung sign para mas madali. O, sige. So, dun sa kaliwa ng negative 6, test natin. So, for example, negative 7. So, this is negative 7 plus 6. So, that is negative over negative 7 minus 8. That is negative. Multiplied by negative 7 plus 3. That is still negative. This is negative over positive. So, this is negative. Since negative po yan, hindi po yan kasali. Bakit sir IJ? Kasi naging greater than 0 po yan. Nakalagay greater than 0. Ulitin ko baka nalito. Lahat ng negative 6, let's say negative 7. Negative 7 plus 6, negative 1 yun. Kaya ginawa ko na lang negative. Negative 7 minus 8, that is negative. Negative 7 plus 3, that is negative. Negative times negative, positive. Negative over positive, that is negative. Since greater than 0 siya, hindi kasali. Okay? Case 2 tayo mga Lodi. O ba mas madali natin na susolve. Uh, between naman ng negative 6 and negative 3. So ano in between dyan mga Lodi? Negative 4. Try nyo yung negative 4. Kaya kailangan makinig kayo maigi. That is the essence na yung ginagawa natin itong tutorial na to. For you to listen. Since sa online classes napakahirap mga Lodi yun. Yun lang siguro yung pinaka beneficial na at least may mga YouTube channels na tayo ngayon na Filipino educa educators na yun. Nakakapagturo ng gandong klase ng subjects. So, hindi lang ako, syempre, marami pang ibang mga lodi. Marami kayo matututunan sa kanila. Okay, so try natin yung negative 4. So, negative 4 plus 6, that is positive 2. Therefore, positive over negative 4 minus 8, negative. Negative 4 plus 3, that is negative. Therefore, positive over positive is positive. Greater than 0, check na po yan, sir, IJ. Diba? Dumadali lang yung approach natin. Case 3, between naman ng negative 3, uh, and positive 8 Siyempre, isip ka ng in-between sa kanila Eh, di 0 na lang So, 0 yung gamitin natin 0 plus 6 That is 0 I mean, sorry, that is positive Sorry, positive over 0 minus 8 That is negative 0 plus 3 That is positive So, negative times positive That is negative Positive over negative That is negative Therefore, hindi siya kasali Kasi negative, hindi naman siya greater than 0 Okay? Last case, case 4. Diba? Biglang bumilis yung approach natin. At least, ginamit lang natin yung mga signs. Hindi na natin in-evaluate para at least mas, much, letter, much lesser computation natin. Case 4, x greater than 8. Siyempre, try natin yung 9. 9 plus 6, that is positive 15 or that is positive. Over 9 minus 8, 
that is 1 or that is positive multiplied by 9 plus 3 that is positive positive over positive that is still positive since greater than 0 siya check po yan sir IJ so paano natin isusulat mga Lodi interval notation yun marunong na si Lodi dahil in between siya nito sir IJ tapos hindi po siya kasali magiging negative 6 exclusive papunta ng negative 3 another exclusive Union po siya, Sir IJ, ng 8 pa kanan since naka-unshade siya or I mean what you call this, yung wala siyang shade mga Lodi or tama, unshaded niya so, or shallow siya, obviously hindi kasali yung 8 papunta ng infinity Ito na yung magiging final answer natin for problem number 2 Ganun po siya, itest natin yung mga sign, di ba? Para at least, mas madali If ever, naman na may questions kayo, okay mahiya mga Lodi Sobrang welcome kayo sa akin so, just in case you have questions or clarifications, don't forget to comment on the comment section, mga Lodi. Sana may natutunan kayo for, for today and I hope you all the best. Magpalaan kayo, Lord. And yung mga Lodi, subscribe din pala kayo sa mga Derico. Mary Ann Maling po yung pangalan niya. More on mga cooking, so mga foods. So, yun yung hobby, yun yung favorite kasi ni Mami. So, yun. Subscribe din kayo sa kanya, mga Lodi. Yung orange na profile. And, ayun. I hope you all the best. Keep safe na lang, especially pandemic ngayon. See you on my next match tutorial video. And, bye-bye.